Okay, should I buy or just spy? You know my ass will go right across the street from some store, some high-end store, and take out my binoculars and just admire whoever buys whatever I want. Hola. Y bienvenido a Styling Your Lipstick. El pita labio que tengo puesto para este video is by Charlotte Tilbury. Tilbury. <laughs> Charlotte Tilbury, and it's called The Wedding Bells. The holidays are right around the corner. Yes, they are. They freaking are. And it's incredible because I feel like I haven't like processed time. I can't keep up with time. I feel like I'm still in summer mode. And here we are, we're in fall. It's crazy. It's freaking crazy. And it's making me crazier. So I make my little list for the holiday. So you tell me, should I buy or should I just buy? Shoe edition. Let's get into it, bitches. The first one by Chanel. The Shirley High Boot. Ay, ay, ay. Isn't this the quintessential New York City boot? Well, maybe you didn't think New York City, but the reason why I say that is because I'm always freezing here and we have like really cold winters here. Like if we're in Alaska, wait a second. I just noticed my light is not facing where it should be on me, but it's like somewhere out there. Like I was saying, <laughs> I would rock these. Oh my God. I was thinking of putting these on my wish list until I looked at the freaking price. This shit is 2,125. I'm definitely just gonna spy these. We have things we wanna do in life, you know what I mean? And it's not all about buying shoes, okay? I know, I can't believe I said that, but it's the truth. I mean, I wanna get like, never mind. But these come in blue, these come in black, and these come in like this creamy color. Oh my God. I wish I can put this on my list. I wish I could buy, but honestly, there, there is no way I'm gonna buy this, so I'm just gonna keep spying. Cause you know I'll be spying on your ass to see if you ever go on sale. But Chanel never holds sale. That bitch hates me. Numero dos. Okay, you know, like I stated initially, it's going to be like for the holidays. You know, I wanna go a little bit high end, you know, because Daisy deserves it. Let's go to Valentina. Look at these boots that are out right now. These are Atelier Rose Edition rubber boots. And these cost $980. And this comes in black and it comes in white. I don't know. These are kind of interesting. I'm really trying to figure out if I really like the rose patterns, the texture on this. But I saw it on someone and it looked beautiful. Like I saw the white one and I was like... Wow, would I want to get white boots? They're rubber, so they're not going to be like so high maintenance, you know? I don't know. I low-key like these. Should I buy or should I just buy? I don't know. I saw it on the person in the white version. It low-key looked really cute. I was like, let me find out. I'm going to put that on my little holiday list. Should I buy you or just buy you? Let's be honest, I can't buy everything, so I'm going to need your help. Oh my God, you know I have a foot fetish. I freaking love feet. Shoot. <laughs> Look at these by Loewe. Loewe. I feel like my lips get bigger when I say that. Loewe. <laughs> okay. <laughs> these are the wedge loafer boot and they are running for $1,100. Oh my God, these are so cute. They're fashion forward so punky so cool i love it i love the white ones but oh i could never get white shoes because they just get so dirty but look how beautiful they look like i want the white ones even if i was to go there like i would not buy the white ones because just knowing that they're gonna get dirty but damn they look so good i don't know should this be the one should i buy you or just buy you like i've been doing and i have no shame in my game should i buy these or should just spy on these and these come in multiple colors like i've seen obviously this white and black one is the one i'm drawn to the most then they have these brown and black ones and they have like this mustard color and black and then they have like this cognac and black oh my gosh should i buy or just buy damn so many shoes to little feet to little greens what do i do with myself should i go to rehab mm. you tell me should i buy or just buy would this be my shoe for the holidays for my birthday? Oh my god, how cute are these by Balenciaga? Ay, ay, ay. These are the square knife pumps in black and it's faux fur. Look how adorable this is. These are running for $950. These are super cute. I've seen them in black, which is probably the one I would get. I've seen this in like a hot pink number which is also fabulous too to be honest with you as much as i'm drawn to the black the pink in the middle of winter this would look so beautiful too i don't know like there's so 
many shoes and I know I can't buy them all. This one is beautiful. I don't know. I don't know. Should I buy you and not spy you or should I not buy you and just still spy you? What the fuck did I just say? I don't even know what I said. It's like wearing bunnies on my feet. Fake bunnies. Because I would never wear real bunnies. Ooh, these are like some futuristic goodies. These are by Prada. I don't have shit in my collection by Prada. These are the Napa Tech platform boots and look how futuristic they are even though they're not to the 70s. But to me, they're giving me butt type of style, like futuristic, robotic, dystopian type of like look and vibe. I think these are sexy. I, I feel like I could wear this with like super tight tights and the beautiful little knit tube top with the sweetheart neckline and just really play up like that futuristic type of look with it. <laughs> Even like a knit dress that has some kind of cut out long sleeve with these type of shoes. Can you picture it? Because I sure as hell am. These cost $1,450 and this is also something that I can wear every day. I honestly don't know if I should buy or just buy. I'm confused as hell, mama mia call the foot patrol because i can't contain myself i feel like i'm olding on shoes and rightfully so because look at these by lv you know we have history like that so i call them my initials but in case you don't know it's louis vuitton <laughs> these are the patty wedge boots and they're going for two thousand four hundred and seventy dollars and i could already tell you right off the bat that i will be spying these and not buying because for two thousand that's way out of my range I will not give 2000 and change for a pair of shoes, but um, damn! This has like that street wear, street edge type of style that I would wear also every day. I could see it fitting in lovely into my collection, but for $2,470, you're definitely one I will be spying from the rooftop. They're edgy. They're not for everybody, but they're edgy and like cool. They have that cool aesthetic, like that cool downtown european slash dominican brazil i think we should look to the next one two more and wait for the last one because if that doesn't scream holiday i don't know what does but look at these for now these are the hottest shoe right now by versace the medusa satin pumps i want i want these and they come in like delicious yummy candy colors i've seen them in like a hot pink fuchsia color like in a lime green and yellow type of color i've seen them in black i've seen them in red honestly i do not know which color i would get but i feel like if i'm gonna go for something like this i should just go all out and get like a color right this is the time to wear the color with a shoe like this I mean, look how stunning it is. It's platforms, it's high. I haven't bought something like this in so long. But the thing with this is, again, like, where am I going to wear it? I mean, it sucks. Yeah, they will be great, and I will utilize them for the holidays coming up. So as beautiful as they are, I am not going to get my money's worth with these type of shoes, even though they look so good. I will not be buying this, so I'm not even going to ask should I buy it, but I will definitely be spying on you. Oh my God, the last one. Hold on to your toupee, bitches. This screams freaking holidays. I want this so bad. I'm not sure if you say this brand, Mock and Mock or Mosh and Mosh, Match and Match, Mock and Mock. But I will put it here because I'm not really sure. Look at the glitter. Holy shit, I have like goosebumps all over my body. This shoe is making me want it so bad. Mama mia, these are so shiny, shiny. This is like Cinderella on drugs. That's how shiny this thing is. If you love crystals and glitz and shine and high shine, this is it for you. This screams freaking holidays. I would love to sport this shit for my birthday. But honestly, it pains me. It really pains me to say that I'm just gonna spy on these. Because again, where am I gonna wear them? I don't know. It doesn't justify the price for me, you know? Oh man, but they're so gorgeous. These cost $1,133. And I've seen PVC clear one and then PVC like black. And they're so shiny. That is just so sexy. Ugh. 
I want these. I want these. My heart is telling me yes, I want them. And my mind is playing a bigger role telling me what the hell are you going to do with these? Where are you going to wear them? This one I'm not going to buy. I'm just going to keep spying forever. Which one should I get? Thumbs up or thumbs down. Subscribe today to embark on a more magical and fashionable lifestyle. And hit that bell so you will be notified of my next video. Don't forget to watch my next video.